I can't remember the last time I've seen all my children in one room. None of you even bother to answer the phone when I call. Answer the phone for what? All you do is ask for money. Or a ride when you have your own car, but don't want to waste your gas, but want to waste everybody else's gas. Hey, not too much on my mama. Not too much on the underage females, Tommy. Or your nieces. Tell me, why are we here? I am dealing with a lot right now, and I don't have time to sit here and listen to your kids argue. Your kids? So you're above us, Tamika? Terry, shut up! I am above this. And you know I'm the wrong sister to be trying to argue with. I will air your shit the fuck out. Again, Tammy, why are we here? When did I become Tammy? That's your name, isn't it? What do you have going on that is more important than what I'm about to say? You see, I have kids that I'm actually a mother to. And right now I'm dealing with their poor decisions in life. But I'm gonna be okay. I'm gonna be all right. I just prefer not to deal with you or your bullshit. Mika, what happened now? <laughs> Brian got a girl pregnant. Brian? I didn't know he had it in him. Wait, I thought he was the gay one. He is. You know who else is gay? Your twin boys, who also think that they're Disney princesses. I get it. You're a single mother who is divorced, has no man, can't get a man, because you're always angry and bitter. I'm married, happy, and I understand. Your wife weighs approximately 600 pounds. God almighty. You have to put bricks under y'all's bed because of her oversized back. The last time you slept with her, she tried to climb on top of you and sent you to the emergency room for broken ribs and a crushed lung. Are you still having trouble breathing? Fuck. The only person I shared that with is you, Tara, so clearly you can't keep your fucking mouth shut. How's Tarika? Did she ever find out who her baby daddy was? Tamika, I told you that in confidence. Right, you did. And he made me share it publicly. See, my nephew got him somebody pregnant. I knew he liked him some coochie. I'm proud of him. Mama, why are we here? Ah, it's been a minute since we argued. I feel like starting some shit. Tanya, tell Tamika that you slept with her ex-husband. Tanya! You slept with Michael? Tamika, no. I would never do that to you. He slept with me well after y'all's divorce. And I told him that he was wrong for that. Like, how could you sleep with your ex-wife's sister? Tanya, how could you? He slept with me. It's the same thing, you bitch. No, it's not. He came to me. You could have said no, Tanya. It's not in my vocabulary. I love men. I am a whore. And I get it from my mama. You like this shit, don't you? Seeing us argue and be against each other, you like that. Y'all have been arguing since y'all was kids, and I am tired of trying to stop it. So when y'all are ready to hear what I have to say, let me know. Tanya, you are insane. You want to know what's insane, Terry? Your wife being banned from every buffet in the state of Texas because she decided to wipe one out in Houston. I mean, she cleared out the entire restaurant and then had the audacity to ask the employees to fill up more food trays. I mean, bitch, how about you throw some of it back up? Fuck. Another thing I shared with only you, Tara. You did. And it's my fault for thinking that I could share your business with our sisters in confidence. I won't do it again. Y'all keep going. I love the abuse. Shut up, Tommy. You are literally the youngest and the dumbest. And mama's favorite. Mama, don't forget that Tara and Tamika slept with your ex-husband, Earl. Did you know that Earl was your real daddy and told mama to get rid of you when she found out she was pregnant with you? You look lost. She never told you that Earl was your real daddy? No? Oh, Tamika. What are you talking about? We all have the same daddy. You sound crazy. Our father died before your ass was conceived. Mama, she's lying. Tell her. Tell her she's lying. Oh, Tammy, you look hurt. 
Go ahead and tell him that the man that you accused me of Tara sleeping with was his real daddy. And also tell him that he never claimed him or loved him. You know what, Tamika? You are your mother's daughter. Whether you want to accept it or not, you and me are just the same. I have stage three cancer. I do hope that little information brings y'all all together. Have a good day. Take a bit of work